we have voter suppression that's going on in this country and hardly anybody is talking about it. It's outlandish. It is an outrage. It should not be tolerated. We have a school-to-prison pipeline in this country that is like really sick. Really sick. And what they're trying to do to public education, it's just unbelievable. When did the teachers become the worst people in our society? I don't know how that happened. When I grew up, it was a respected profession. Now, so they're all, I guess they're all evil. I mean, I don't know. Who, and, and all these teachers that they want to fire to make the school system wonderful again, who are they going to replace those teachers with? So we need to be angry. Some of the anger that I saw when I was growing up in the 1950s and in the 1960s, I want to see some of that anger out there again. Occupy Wall Street is fine, but they're not mad enough. They're not angry enough. They're not raising enough hell. I want to see more hell raised in this society. I want to see people get up in the face of powers that be. I want to see something done about the inequality in this society. I want to see working people be able to go to work again at jobs that pay enough to raise a family and they can put their kids through college and when it comes time to retire, they can retire in a way that has some dignity to it. We need to change things in this society. And they're not going to change unless more people get angrier. So I want to see some anger. I don't want violence out there. I'm a follower of Dr. Martin Luther King. But I do want to see anger and I want to see people get up in the face of people. I want to see the politicians and the office holders pressured.